Hello, hello, mic test. I'll just run this uh, cell again and you'll see, oh my God, a lot of data is coming in front of us. Perfect. So you can see this WebSocket is running and extracting information of Apple, Microsoft, Tesla continuously. And this is the price, right? So yeah, this is how easy it is to uh, use the WebSocket of Entrino to extract the real-time prices. Hello financial programmers, I'm Rithvik Dashora and I'm back with a new video and some new learnings. This is the third video of our playlist on Intrino financial data provider. In the first video, we saw the entire functionalities that Intrino provides. In the second video, we, we dig deeper into the API documentation. We also checked on all different types of modules that we can use to extract some very useful financial information directly in Python with minimal effort. In this video, we are going to learn how to extract the real time prices of multiple stocks at once. Yes, guys, you're right. This uh, in this video, I'll be talking about extracting real time prices of many stocks, right? Which is basically running a batch file. So we'll be extracting information of say Tesla, Apple, Microsoft at once right but before that guys if you're new to my YouTube channel on this channel I turn my viewers to successful financial programmers here I upload videos related to implementation of AI in finance using some highly valuable finance API's making trading bots and pine script trading strategies etc etc so if there's something that you're interested in then just click on the subscribe button and also hit on the bell icon because there are many more videos and playlists that are coming on my YouTube channel very soon and I am hundred percent sure that this one free click for you is going to be worth millions because you are going to learn a lot on this YouTube channel and everything is for free. What are the topics that we are going to cover in this video? We'll see how to extract the real time prices of uh, stocks using Intrino API. Uh, we'll just see some basic about the last videos, right? Um, we'll also understand the SDK Python package that we'll be using, which is basically a WebSocket Python package. And then we'll be extracting the real time prices uh, of multiple stocks in Python, right? I'm using Google Colab. Uh, in this video as well. In the first video, I mentioned that if you chat with the team here uh, in the uh, in the uh, bubble uh, speech bubble on the right bottom, and mention that you came from my YouTube channel, which is Financial Programming with Ritwik, and just present the coupon code of Ritwik to them, then they will give you an extended free trial version, which is of one month, and then the next two months will be only 50% of the entire cost, which is very, very cheap. So make sure that guys, you use that trial period because I don't want you guys to pay a lot of money in the beginning. You pay even single cent only if you are uh, convinced about this particular API. And I think you will be. So uh, make sure that you get that free trial in the beginning by talking to the team here on the bubble section. In the last video, we explored the uh, Intrino SDK Python package. We saw multiple functions that we can use. Perfect. Uh, in this video, I'll be referring to the uh, this particular uh, SDK, which is an extended version of the, the SDK uh, Python package that we used in the last video, right? We will install the library, which is basically pip install in three new real time, and, right? And then here they have given a basic code of data extraction using the WebSocket, right? SDK for working with in three new real time multi exchange price feed bridges the gap by merging real time equity prices from the IEX or MEMX exchange, right? Yeah. So I'll be using the IEX real time price. Uh, let's directly jump to the Python code. So let's. Uh, Copy this pip install in Trino real time. I'll come here, paste it. Let's run this, and then this will install the in Trino real time uh, SDK Python package in Google Colab. Right. Meanwhile, I'll come here. Let's see what uh, type of features do they offer. Receive streaming real time prices quotes last trade bid ask subscribe to the uh, updates for individual security subscribe to updates for all securities and so on. Right. Perfect. Handing the codes uh, and the queue. Mm -hmm. This is all the type of information that we'll get. Right. This is the way we'll get the information as well, and so on. Yeah. This is this one for the the code, which is basically the the price, the real time price that is. Of any particular security, it's. I think it's straightforward. I'll just uh, directly come here. I will copy this particular code. Let's come here. Yeah, the um, library is already installed. I'll paste this and let's see if we run this uh, particular cell, this should 
actually uh, give us real time information right using the WebSocket. right i'll have to provide my api key here and let's run this cell but before this i would like to get it only for apple let's run this right join channel apple actually we get information about the trades ask and bid count right a number of trades which are happening and so on right uh, let's uh, actually i'm not very interested in the count i'm more interested in the exact price so i'll just do some basic changes here just uh, before that guys i have a very important information to share recently i launched a course on uh, python for financial programming so if you are trying to learn python for finance from scratch then this is something that you might be interested in just go to my website which is fpritwick.com slash python over here you will see two buttons indian candidates non-indian candidates so you can click as per your uh, location it will redirect you to this the main website where the entire course information is available you'll see that uh, there are five sessions 10 chapters 22 videos 10 quizzes and three assignments with two live projects and uh, uh, this is the entire syllabus of this course for all the people who are interested to learn python from scratch and who are struggling learning python on their own i highly recommend it because uh, it's very very affordable and i have covered a lot of things from a very very simplistic eyesight and in the end in session four and five you'll see stock analysis and investment portfolio creation projects which are my personal projects we did it using some financial analysis if you use rtk40 code uh, you'll get an instant 40 percent discount which is only available for the first 100 candidates so yes guys i'll see you in the course let's come back to our code let me just include uh, include some other stocks as well msft and say tesla tsla right here i would have to do some changes here i'll again come back to the uh, documentation i remember that there was a quote yeah yeah here we go so i'll just copy this right let's copy this and uh, i will paste it here right print code and code and back backlog length i am not interested in backlog length i just want code let me just come back to the uh, this section on trade function right i'll again come back here i'll paste on trade i don't want backlog length we don't need to understand this particular code guys but uh, if, like i'll just very quickly go through the entire code that we have pasted we have imported some of the libraries like like threading threading is used for running uh, multiple layers at one time right so for example we will be doing it for apple microsoft tesla so for that threading is important time is a normal uh, library which actually can be used to sleep the code and something related to uh, like some activities related to time from threading import timer and a thread event right and this is the authentic authentication library that we have imported in the last video as well some of the basic uh, inputs that they provide in the beginning and then the there are a few functions that we are using on quote on trade right and then summarize this is the class that we would be referring to in the end right and api key and the provider is real time right because we want real time data it can be real time delayed sip nasdaq basic i'll just stick to the real time client this is the one basically uh, we will we are actually doing authentication here as well by providing the options here right on trade is this function which is being run uh, uh, and then on code which is another function which is we are running we are subscribing to these three uh, tickers which is apple microsoft and tesla right we are connecting the websocket right and then in the end we are uh, displaying different things and sleeping the code for 10 seconds okay perfect so again as i mentioned at the beginning we don't need to uh, understand this code in detail because thanks to intrinio documentation they have already provided a very good sample on how to use this uh, to extract the real time prices i'll just run this uh, cell again and you'll see oh my god a lot of data is coming in front of us perfect so you can see this websocket is running and extracting information of apple microsoft tesla continuously and this is the price i just stopped the code and you can see the prices are very real time uh, and with multiple decimal point precision right which is one two three four five six seven eight. thirteen decimal points precision which is amazing right so yeah this is how easy it is to uh, use the websocket of entrenio to extract the real time prices we can definitely increase the number of tickers here to extract the information for i would say more companies but uh, yeah the only thing is that we'll have to manage it to clean the data accordingly 
and then uh, then use it in your personal projects so i'll be saving this particular code as well in my google drive and uh, how to get the access of my google drive just one second guys uh, but before that guys if you liked even one thing about this video just click on the like button and because it's really important for the algorithm and also click on the subscribe button and hit on the bell icon as i mentioned in the beginning that there are many more videos that are coming on this youtube channel and it's completely worth clicking on that particular red button because this will be a game changer for you guys with the amazing content that i will put on my youtube channel very soon for freelancing inquiries you can reach out to my team at this email address and we will reply to you as soon as possible okay how to become a google drive community member just search financial programming with rithvik on youtube and click on my channel over here just click on this particular link uh, which will redirect you to a post and here i have actually provided step by step uh, information about how to become a co community member you'll see that it's it cost less than a coffee and i the reason i'm charging this small amount of money because i hired a couple of interns to uh, to provide the best possible content on my google drive and this is how you'll be supporting my work as well on my google drive i will save that particular code and not only this one uh, there are many more codes available on that platform such as my trading bot some of my personal projects my pine script strategies etc etc so yes guys definitely check it out and yes guys also if you're someone who is exploring python for finance from scratch then i highly recommend you to check out my uh, course on python for financial programming which is made for beginners if you know python already then please don't click on the link in the description section if you are willing to learn from scratch then yes guys this is something for you thank you so much guys for watching this video till the end you can click here to subscribe to my youtube channel and over there you'll see this entire playlist of entrainio and over there you'll see uh, my video on mt5 trading bot that i made a few weeks ago keep learning keep financial programming i'll see you in the next video next saturday till then peace